seat wherever you like. Welcome to the governor's office. We'll be serving tea in a moment when the governor comes out. Hello, how are you? Hello. 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 Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Well, sit down, please. Well, this is really exciting. I got a phone call yesterday from my very good friend, Donald Trump. <laughs> <laughs> he called me and says, you got to see my people. He says, they're, they're at the top of the line. No, pro no problem at all, no problem. So it's, it's good to have you out here. Thank you. Any questions that you have? One question I do have is, you came here as an immigrant. Right. I came here when I was uh, three years old with my father. We had nothing, and we really had to live the American dream. I'm wondering what got you through some of those hardships of people saying, no way, he can't do it. When I came over here, I didn't want to get into the movie business. What do you think? The first thing I heard was, it can't be done. It can't be done. He says, you have an accent. What about your name? I mean, a name like that, what is it, Schwarzen Schnitzel or something like that? He said, no one ever, can you imagine starring Schwarzen Egg or whatever you better say? So forget, so, but I said, that's what I want to do. And then eventually it did happen, you know, and I became the highest paid entertainer. It all because I never looked at and listened to, it can't be done. This is uh, the best place in the world. This has opportunities here that are endless. But the key thing is, you got to be hungry. It's all about how willing are you to go through your pain barrier. There was a scene that we shot in Conan the Barbarian, and that to crawl on the rocks, and there was bleeding on the elbows and my knees, and there was crawling, and the director said, we have to do one more take, do you mind? I said, no, I don't care, because pain is only temporary, but what is on that film is permanent. One thing that really stuck out that the governor said was that pain would go away and that film would be there forever. So that was just like, why did I come here? I came here to work for Mr. Trump and I will leave here working for Mr. Trump. I don't care how much it hurts. I don't care if I don't sleep for the next month. That's what I came here for and I have to keep my eyes on it. So the more you succeed, the more people are trying to attack you. That remember, for every attack, there's a defense. So as soon as someone puts you in a vulnerable position, you have to quickly figure out how to go all out and, and, and win. That's what it's all about.